Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my I don't know what kind of intro that was, but let's jump right in. The first thing in the box is the Real Her Blush Kit. Oh yeah, and this month is Glitz and Glam. I'm all over the place with this video. Um, this retails for $32. It says, treat your cheeks to an instant natural glow with three shimmery tones. So let's go ahead and open this bad boy. And of course, I've already opened it. So it did have plastic all over it. And on the back of it, it says it's paraben free, certified cruelty free, gluten free, and natural ingredients. And I've never actually heard of Real Her. With the front of it, it says be fearless, be limitless. It's kind of cool. These are the three like blush, baked blushes. I'm actually not wearing any of this because I don't really wear blush all that much. These are more like shimmery shades. I did swatch them earlier, but I'll go ahead and swatch them. Okay, I'm just going to swatch from this side over, but I'm going to set it down so I can get kind of some pigment. Okay, this one is the color Fearless, and I'm just going to swatch it. And of course, my like skin looks see-through. There's the Fearless, and now we're going to do Limitless. And I'll just do it right here. And that one's Limitless, and then we're going to do Unstoppable. And these are all like super glittery shades and they're not super pigmented which is kind of cool because I don't really wear blush all that much and there's the three colors and it comes in this cute little like magnetized case I'm not gonna lie I wasn't really excited about this because I don't wear blush all that much the second thing in the box is a crown brush this is a deluxe blush brush blush brush and it's just a little brush and this retails for $12. It says, with super soft, dense, synthetic bristles, this brush can be used with both powder and cream blushes and provides medium to full coverage for a more dramatic finish. And this is the brush. I did dip into the blush with it to see. Yeah. The next thing in the, in the box I'm actually wearing on my lips, it smells really citrusy. And I like the color of it because, as I've said in my previous videos, I love, like, nudish, sparkly colors. So, this is pretty vulgar. My lips are sealed, lightweight liquid lipstick. This retails for $24. A highly pigmented liquid lipstick that provides a radiant metallic finish, nice, comfortable, creamy texture, and a citrus flavor. My lips don't feel gooey like they do, like with other lip glosses on it. So, that's pretty nice. And the packaging is really cute. I've actually never heard of Pretty Vulgar before. I'm trying to get it to focus. Sorry. Yeah, kind of. Well, it says Pretty Vulgar on the top, and I got the shade My Lips Are Sealed, and I definitely see myself wearing this. The next thing in the box I'm actually wearing as well, it's the Tarte Tartiest. I have no idea how to say that, and I actually have the palette in, in my vanity, and I have no idea how to say it. So I just call it Tartiest could be called Tardist. I don't know what it's called. I call it Tardiest. Uh, mascara. This retails for $23. It's a jet black vegan mascara that has a molded brush that grabs and coats even the tiniest lashes for $2,700 more volume. Percent more volume. And I like this brush. And I swear by Better Than Sex by Too Faced. But I really like this mascara. Like, the bristles are cool. And it just glides on. And... It makes my lashes look like two times longer. This is actually only one layer. I usually wear about three layers, so this is nice. The next thing in the box is a Beauty Basics Bronze Essentials. This retails for $39.95. Use individually or mix together for your ultimate bronze and glow. I was not excited about this at all. It feels really cheap. I mean, to each their own. Maybe some of you liked it, but it feels really cheap and it looks really weird and it kind of feels like sand um, but it is kind of pretty I mean the gold color is kind of pretty but I'm not a fan of that and I'm actually not wearing the, that this today I wear my Becca highlighter and I'm wearing my what contour am I wearing Anastasia contour kit But this came in the box as well as the last item, which 
I guess it'd be pretty cool. Maybe I'll wear it in the summer. I don't know, but I just wasn't very excited about it. Like the packaging that it comes in looks really cheap and it just, the letters are already wearing off and I literally just opened it. So if you like this product that came in your box, tell me how you use it. Let me know how you like it and how it works for you. Same with the blush because I don't really wear blush all that much. I remember in like, I think it was October or November's box, they actually sent out this blush and I've used it twice, but I really like this blush. So let me know in the comments down below if you like the Real Her blush and how you use it because I figured I'll use the like bronzy color as a like a light contour, like when I want to do like a light contour, like a less dramatic. Um, let me know how your box went for you. I will have my BoxyCharm link down below so you can go subscribe if you don't know what BoxyCharm is. I paid $21 for all of this and I get it at my door once a month. It's a subscription so it automatically pulls out. It's way better than Ipsy in my opinion because um, you get full size products and I paid $21 and this box weighed one pound and I get this huge well not really huge but this box and I get it full of makeup four to five products for $21 a month so definitely go check out BoxyCharm if you're not comfortable using my link you can always go to BoxyCharm.com I will have that link down there below as well make sure to follow my social media I am going to start uploading four times a week Actually, after I get done filming this video, I'm going to film another video that was requested. Um, I'm going to start trying to upload four times a week. I am going to try to start interacting with y'all more and figuring out what my channel is going to be. When I'm going to upload more to my channel, I'm going to start trying to edit better. I'm going to try to start doing more for my YouTube channel because this is actually really fun for me. Um, so if you have any ideas or requests or anything, just leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know some requests and what I can be doing to better my channel. Just let me know. And thank you guys so much. Subscribe and some thumbs up.